YouTube, this is Uncle Momo's music reaction channel where I provide my views on talented artists from around the world, both established artists and non established artists. And I promise you that you won't be disappointed whatsoever. So why don't you come and join me in discovering amazing, talented artists and bringing it to the forefront of my channel for us to view. Now, my next reaction, we're going to go over to Ukraine again. This particular artist I haven't reacted to before. I only just got under 2,000 subscribers. So please go to his channel, check him out. Um, I believe um, he is somebody that will definitely interest you. His name is Santuri. Uh, and I hope I'm pronouncing that, or Santorin. Uh, this particular track is called New Life. Now, in the description page, as you know, I like to read out, um, there is some of the lyrical contents. It says, did you search how to invent that bike for three, for 39 lands? But he delayed here myself. Is it Zerbia is an abyss? Zerbia is everything. I understood immediately as he left on that highway. I squinted from the sun and in the deserve 58, I read the happiness they do not lease. The whole cringe of assistance. I didn't see through pink lenses like in a bath. The icy iron is here. Now, it does not make sense when I read it out. But when you put it in terms of a song, it just comes all clear. Wouldn't you agree? Right. Now, if you haven't done already, please subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to hit the notification button to indicate to you when my next uploads will be. Now, I'll also, I have a Facebook and Instagram account, um, Uncle Mama Music Reactions. If you like to send me a message there, I'd be more than happy to send you various links that these amazing artists are carrying out within their own terms. And when I'm talking about that is they've got some a number of projects uh, in ways of supporting uh, Ukraine. And I'll be more than happy to send you those links. Um, it's on my community page. Some of them are on my community page. But majority of them are on my Facebook and my Instagram account. So that's Uncle Momo's uh, Music Reactions. And that's both on Facebook. Or just type in Uncle Momo um, on Instagram and Facebook and you can find me. I'm, I'm also sorting out my Patreon page as well. I just don't quite understand it. So if you know anything about Patreon, then send me a message and help me get that on ball and, and started. That's where I'm going to put all of my blocks. Um, reactions um, on that page there and just for you guys to check it out now without further ado you know what we're here for great vocabs and a damn good video audio music as well as your support can you dig it <laughs> I love when you, the instruments don't make sense in the beginning, it makes sense as it goes on. What's he building? Very awkward. This is different. Everything about this track is just... 
unorthodox with a hip hop beat. Brilliant. Then you've got traditional culture in there, vibe in there. Uh, very unexpected, but pleasantly surprised on this one. So that was Santorin uh, with New Life. And the second part of the lyrical contents uh, is not in the background and not on the background. I was smouldering with that cigarette on the balcony. In this own little world or butchery, I built my life more bright and beautiful. I don't have a plan A. That's why there is a plan B. How I build my life. I am my new self. It's not like that for me. Why did he give such a fate? I will build a new life. And there's more lyrical contents. Please just highlight it, put it into Google Translate. And hopefully Google Translate will translate it to at least 99% or, you know, 90% of it. Um, the visuals was absolutely uh, amazing. Now, I was having a, wor a conversation with Nat Merrim. Good morning, how are you doing? Uh, and also, good morning, Tom. How are you doing, mate? I hope you're, right, um, you're well. And good morning to all of my Ukrainian subscribers um, as well. Uh, and all my subscribers, in fact. Um, but I believe I was having a word with um, Nat Merrim where we were talking about how many new uh, Ukrainian artists are just coming out from the woodworks uh, and to express themselves of what's going on here. And it's like, well, where did these all these artists coming from? It's kind of like suspicious. And I feel that at the beginning, I was like, wow, you know, I, you may have a point there. But at the same time, it's like certain effects in one's country will give you so many different kind of... It will give people who would ne not necessarily drive that mount um, within oneself to come out and say, look, I've got to do something. I need to do something and express themselves. It will have a someone who just naturally sings that will write a, a song, uh, you know, or someone that don't normally sing, but can sing, will write a song and do something about it because they want to, I think it's a case of they need, one needs to do something about it rather than sit down and watch. And if you have it in your soul, in your body that you feel that you can to do it, then you're God's chosen person to do something about it. Regardless if it's in, going to the front line, writing a song, helping uh, defenseless people um, who can't defend themselves, you know, doing your part, so to speak. It's a calling and it's in your spirit, it's in your soul, you know. Um, so I believe it's quite right that there will be more artists coming out that I've never even dreamed about or heard about or anything that's doing spectacular things. And my arms are widely open um, to brace every single uh, one of you. Really is. Um, th this song, when it came on, the instruments that was used at the beginning, I wouldn't... Uh, it's completely different. It was completely different. And that's what kind of intrigued me more from the way how it started, this kind of labyrinth feel. And then you had, then you had the beat, which, okay... I recognise the beat. I mean, it, it was lovely. It was something that I can like familiarise myself with, but also capturing everything and how it bring everything in together. It showed me a different kind of diverse talent that that um, that one can find in Ukraine. And um, I'm not saying it's it's hard to find these diverse uh, artists, but it's very hard to locate them. <laughs> do you know and I'm just, and once in a while when you're doing a reaction you'll come across an, uh, 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 an artist that is so orthodox unorthodox that's not following that same path as everybody else when it comes to term of that genre style of music and they're given all of their own um, characteristics in the song and that's what I felt um, about this particular artist it was it threw me off but it still made sense you know it's like seeing a it's like seeing a purple Ferrari when you know that the Ferrari is always red. You know, it throws you off, but then you look at it and think, well, purple's a really nice colour, you know? And you see how unorthodox that this person is by you know having a purple Ferrari instead of the normal standard red Ferrari, you know? I think they do black and white now. 
Um, but everybody knows when you see a Ferrari, it's red, you know, and yeah, I like the way how he's thinking out the box. I love that, that, and especially with the visuals as well. Everything came together really, really nicely. It's like squiggly lines. Then you turn the page upside down and you see that these squiggly lines weren't squig squiggly lines. They were actually straight. That's what I get. And for that reason, I salute you. Amazing. Come on, you tell me.